Hello, hope everybody's doing great on this Wednesday. It's Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's, everyone. I hope everyone's having a great day. As we all know, <clears throat> number 11, South Carolina, my Gamecocks men's basketball goes on the road to Auburn, Alabama to take on the number 13th ranked Auburn Tigers, War Eagle, whatever they call themselves. I can't keep up with their mascots. Y'all, this is going to be a tough game. Auburn is 19-5, 8-3 and in the SEC. Of course, we're 21-3, and 9-2 and in the SEC. Um, this is going to be a tall task for South Carolina. It, it really, really is. Uh, this, this is. This is a big game. This is a big game. Um, Bruce Pearl, the head coach of the Auburn Tigers, War Eagles, whatever their name is, he was interviewed doing his preview of South Carolina yesterday, and I'll tell you what, it, it, he's a very respectable, respectable coach in the national media in the landscape. And let me tell you what he said. First of all, he said that in 50 meetings, this is the very first time that South Carolina and Auburn were both ranked in the top 25 when facing off. That's a stat I didn't know. Um, he also said he kind of gave his game plan away. He said the fact is that South Carolina is a defensive team, which we all know that. Uh, we dirty up the game. We slow it down, try to um, keep it as low scoring as possible. That His game plan was to try to speed them, speed them up, you know, make the game fast. Um, and get us off of our timing. Well, that's not the important thing of what he said. The important part of what he said is when asked about Coach Paris, he said he was going to go to him before the game and tell him how proud of him he is because he, in 18 months, he's put together a winning program. <clears throat> he said it took him three to four years to do it. He also said that Coach Paris, he can't think of anyone better to win the SEC Coach of the Year other than Lamont Paris. Y'all, that, that speaks volumes coming from someone of his statute in the basketball world. I mean, it speaks volumes. He said, listen, Coach Paris's team was picked to finish last in the SEC. They're now tied for first. He came from Wisconsin. He has brought that defense, that, that, that mindset, that coaching uh, uh, ability he's got for, for defense to the SEC. When someone like that on national television says what I've been saying all year long, actually since last year, that Lamont Paris is a great coach and a great hire. South Carolina fans, if y'all not behind us now, stay where you at. We don't need you. We don't need you. Anyway, had a rough night doing picks last night. I went three and three. Florida kind of went to bed when they blew a 20-point lead with eight minutes to go. But anyhow, South Carolina's 11.5-point underdog. Under over is 137 and a half. I've got to go with my game cocks. Um, getting 11 and a half points, I, I, I've got to. I'm sorry. I, I can't go against them. Don't know what the outcome of the game is going to be. Hope it's a good game. I would also go with the 137 and a half over 137 and a half. Y'all love doing this. This channel is almost at 100 subscriptions. With that being said, I am doing a live tonight. My very first basketball game live with Gamecock Chuck, one of the best statisticians in basketball, especially Gamecocks, that I've ever met in my life. Um, if y'all don't mind, please join us. Please like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Hope everybody has a great day. Let's go Gamecocks. Thank you.